I've just got a brand new refill of some cherry Pepsi Max and I'm prepared to get to the top of the mountain which is some bloody feet right we're gonna make here yeah, this is exactly the same plan so far as we had at the end of last episode is want to get to this chest here see what items I'm hoping fingers crossed it's an oxygen bottle not that I'm short of oxygen bottles I've got two in my inventory but it's it will just give me that top up so that I haven't got to worry about oxygen to get the top of the mountain. My biggest worry at the moment is a uh, um, stamina. The reason is I can't rest in the danger zone without losing oxygen. So really, when you get into the death zone, you're balancing your energy and your oxygen. It's it's either or. You can't have both. And I haven't got any tinned food for energy either. I haven't found any. Then again, if I get tinned food in here, where did we... What encounters did we... There's certain encounters that gave me tinned food, and I can't remember what they were. I know the mysterious stranger has got an option of giving you it if you upset him. But... It's hard. Fuck this one. We did this before and it's a nightmare. Climbing the wall is not worth it. See ya. You might get something good from climbing the wall. But. If you fail it. You not only lose all of that. I'm sure you lose health as well. Because the last time. Oh no. Sorry the last time we did that. We failed halfway through and I'm sure we lost something. I think I tried it again and there was nothing there. It's not worth it that event. Okay. We're going to that. Why on earth? Why on earth would it take me over? No, oh, no, that's actually not that bad. That is a double climb, though. That's going to cost me 7.5 energy, however. Why on earth? Can I not just go that way? Oh, because a... you can't go that way. That's 7.5 energy. If I go to there, it's going to cost no energy. It's going to cost 3 energy to go the longest route. But, this is ice. So remember, I regain sanity on ice. That's good. Only issue I've got here is, I'm going to have this encounter. And these, these are wild cards, these encounters. I'm going to do it see what's in the chest and then we'll hit this up yeah these are I, I hate these people encounters they're so dangerous but I'm at the point now where I need to risk it for a ah, stop 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 right good the optimal route up well not the optimal but the route up takes us past that actually taking us the way I want to go. Look though. How could I get there? Let, let him just stand still for a second. Because if I wish to just scale that mountain, I can do that. Ah. This is, we're so close. The only problem we've got is energy and oxygen. But we can do this because I've got a tent and I've got two oxygen. Lad, this isn't going to be that hard. <laughs> I can even avoid this if I wanted to. I can still get up there. I'm not going to. I'm going to hit these up. Because I think I'm close to a level up. I don't know if you... You don't have an experience bar so you can't see how... Lads, I didn't even know this was a thing. Time lapse. Oh my god, lads. If I'd have known this was the speed of you, the way your guy moves, I would have used it earlier on. I've just found it. Oh, it's the dog. What's the dog going to give us? Something good. A wind charm. Ah. 
That's good. I know it kills body temperature, but it helps with oxygen. And we're doing all right with body temp. I think the the fire charm shit. We're going to swap that for this. I think that's more beneficial. Ha! Huh. If only I'd known about that. It would have made the game a lot faster. But I'm not bothered. You squint as you try to make a... What, what, is this something off Star Wars? I've never seen this before. Behind the rocks, barely recognisable against the landscape as a dome-like structure. The fierce winds have not been kind to it. Its surface is peppered with holes. 12 energy and oxygen. Have a closer look. Let's do it. I want to know what's in there. You slowly walk around the dome. It must have been left here by the occupiers. But what was it used for? You squeeze through a crack in the hollow space. It's full of old wires and coils. Clearly, there was technology wired to all of this, but it has vanished without a trace. You ponder for a moment. Could it really be what you think it is? You feel a creeping sense of unease. You keep walking and trip over a box. It contains some provisions. <gasps> I lost sanity, but we got some canned food. This is just what the doctor ordered. I'm going to use it straight away. Nice. Is it an alien spacecraft? It's going to be daytime as well, so we haven't got to worry about body temperature. Happy days. Oh my god! Why did I not know? Do you know what it is? I think in the first episode I said to myself, oh, I wonder if there's a way of speeding things up, but I don't know why I never hovered over that. Time lapse. Right. So this is going to give us what? These caves are quite good for sanity, I think. Yes, it is. Now, got two options. First one is we can go on that ridge, which I don't think I'm going to do. I just want to, I need to make it to this. Danger, danger, danger. The path up that mountain is going along there. And look, there's a place to rest. Uh, this is the route I'm going. Except that is a hell of a fucking climb. That is a hell of a climb. So I'm going to wait until I get to this here. Then we're going to use... Oh, pause, 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 pause. Ice Boots Baby? And once I get to there, we're going to use... Master Climber and Single Minded. Go for it, baby. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And we're on the ice so our sanity isn't dropping as much. I'm planning on getting to this cave. So, optimal route. This isn't that bad, actually. One hour left of that. Do you know what it is? I'm happy with this climb. No, I'm not. That's going to cost me 21 energy.
20.3 energy, slightly less energy, but in that. Two point three. Yeah, it's much better. My route. My route is the best. That's even better. Only twelve point one energy. That is awesome. Do it, baby. And I, what, I, what I plan on doing is, I think I am going to rest here. There. I'll use an oxygen bottle. I'll rest. Pause, 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 pause. <sighs> Let's think. I can climb up there. But if I did though... Oh. Cross dangerous terrain. That uses too much energy. I, I wouldn't do that. Right, I am going to... I'm going to rest. I know it's going to be night time, but I need the stamina. Lose a bit of body temperature and a bit of oxygen, but that's fine. I can use an oxygen bottle now to boost this up quite high. Boom. Now in a good spot. I want to go around the back of here. I know it's dangerous. There's a few dangerous spots. But remember, I've got careful steps. You know what it is? I don't actually like the time lapse on. A stranger is sitting motionless on a rock. His naked torso is adorned with a number of tattoos, strange patterns and symbols like those mostly worn by the spiritual leaders of the local indigenous people. It's bitterly cold and you wonder whether the stranger has frozen to death. Talk to the stranger. This is, I've never seen this before. Look at this! It's broke! A spiritual journey to what does this even mean? Why would I do that and get an injured torso? I want to do that and get experience. Fuck knows what that fucking lads, that was hilarious. The, the programming was broke. Okay. I'm going to avoid that. There's no dangers here. Good. Go on, bro. See what I want to do? I want to turn speed boost off. Just so I enjoy the scenery. Gives me time to think and observe. Now this could have... Pause. This could have been a mistake. Now the reason this could have been a mistake is because... It's not so bad, actually. There is a way up round here. Although there's a big fucking climb there. Now let's think about this. We're going to go there. That's the smallest climb we can do, or is it? So basically, to get up to there, it's going to cost me... 22.5 energy. You know what I'm thinking? I need the hat on. 8.3 body temp. 9.9, .9, it's not that much difference. 
I've, I've got two flasks for body temperature, so I'm good. I've got one oxygen flask. So that's going to cost me 22.5. Same. It's just massively different. If I go along to there and climb that, that's 75 energy. So the optimal path, oh, sorry, wait there. The optimal path is that. No. That's the best, but it is a dangerous. It is a dangerous. Hmm. I am not risking that. Only thing that's going to give me is sanity. Not worth it. Come on then. Let's get up here. It's a shame I don't have Master Climber. Are we on snow? I don't think these are classed as snow blocks. A bit of speed up action. Don't die. Oh, fuck. Right, we've hurt our ankle. Which is fine. Fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Although I am because it affects my fucking energy. Thirty-eight energy, as opposed to what? Fifty-seven. Yep, yeah, we're definitely going that way. Good thing is it's about to be daytime, so we are going to start recuperating body temperature. Pause a second. Now we can see what we're doing. So this is the... Ah, see, that's not optimal. That's optimal. If I get there, but then what's going to happen is... Forty-two. Thirty-one. Thirty-six. It's slightly better, but you've got dangers. I think I'd rather use this. What's that up there? There's an item there. Thirty eight point five, I'd rather do that. Oh no again. Why do you keep taking the shit roots, mate? Do the damn thing. What's my name? What's my name? Ow. High as fuck boy. Oh look also there's things down there. But remember. We still have to come down the mountain don't we? I think we're good. Mate all of our stats are like good. As long as I don't take a rock to the chest. Or someone murders me. It'll be alright. Oh we're there lads we're there. We're here. I can't actually get to that. Isn't that funny? This is how... This is how we do it! 
This is how we do it. Now, is it though? Shit. That's the only way up? It is the only way. Is that really the only way? The only way is up, baby. You and right, okay, let's 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 plan. Well, that's not the way we're going. We're going there, 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 there. Can't do that. I'm going to this spot. Four hours. We'll use this. Four hours. And then we might be able to make it up there without causing too much stress. Go baby. Go baby. Master climber. Master climb the shit out of this mountain. Let's enjoy this in all of its slow motion glory. My little yellow coated friend. Come on bro, you got this. There's even a thing at the top of here. Is this guy even really doing anything for a report and he's wrote nothing down? This mountain was significantly easier than the second mountain. <laughs> it's probably because we've, we've got a lot of better skills and things. Okay, now. I'm still going to be fucked, but. Some legend hasn't got canned food. What if, lads, what if, where's my other one, there, Thunder Charm, oh, the Thunder Charm, Thunder, 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 Thunder Cat is going to make us so we just have enough fucking energy, <laughs> to get to the top, come on George Michael, whoever you want to be, climb that bad boy. You absolute legend. Do it, baby. Avenia Wimba, what a way. This was a pretty nice climb. There wasn't much drama except at the start when we were fucked. Come on, baby. We have journeyed to the top of the world. Look, Ma! I'm on top of the world! You trudge up to the summit, exhausted, haggard, but alive. Your thoughts are in turmoil. What will you find up here? Maybe a secret base or the remnants of a radar system sending out interference? That would explain why the existence of the island remained a secret for so many years and the concrete foundation you discovered on that last summit? Were they planning to construct another facility there and why? Did they want to control the weather? Or was it for mind control? Your imagination runs wild. The more you think about it, the dizzier you get. As the mist clears, reality hits you like a fist to the face. No antennas, no station. You scrambled you scramble on the ground, searching for every rock, under every rock, sticking your fingers into cracks. Wait, there's something here. What is it? The cold, harsh realities of life. You can feel a box, rectangular, with buttons and a dial, some sort of gauge or measurement instrument. You press the buttons but nothing happens, it's not much, but at least you can write a story about it. You'll talk about a mysterious aggressor experimenting with cutting edge technologies to rule the world from up here. In the secrecy of the mountain of course, you'll have to embellish the story a bit here and there, but who is going to check? <laughs> this guy's a legend, he's just a conspiracy theorist, what a hero. There it is. You didn't win the Pul Pulitzer Prize, but your book about what you discovered in the mountains has been at the top of all the bestseller lists for months. Insurmountable. And there's us, the bad lad on the front of the cover. Also, we don't have to go back down. It was a great success. Took me 39 days to climb three mountains. I got scars, I got damaged ankle, energy cost. Imagine if we went through being safe. We would save so much energy. 
in total, we had minus 25% energy cost penalty equipment. We did get some good equipment. Had some good skills. Master Climber, on the edge, Alpine style. Oh, that was good, because every time we got an extreme dangerous terrain event, we got 250 experience. Yeah. Awesome. It was awesome. I never even really needed to use careful steps. We didn't come across many negative terrain options after we got this. I think if I was to play the game again, I would definitely prioritise activated skills. They're so powerful. And also anything, t definitely temperature. Acclimatise is amazing. It's a shame we only got a chance to... I think the, it only offers you skills randomly. Because we've got acclimatised one. I imagine acclimatised two would be amazing. Inner fire's good. See, the... the strong lungs. Yeah. So lads, I think that is... Is that it? Summit of the journal. Congratulations. You unlock the difficulty hard. Fuck. What, 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 what the hell's hard going to be like? Normal was significantly hard as well. Done. Credits. No credits. I think I want to watch the credits because these people deserve to be acknowledged for this. This game is fucking awesome. It cannot have been a big team. I don't know what it is. I, I, I quite like the idea of just a game where it's just climbing mountains. I would play a survival game in first person if it involved climbing mountains. Or you're not really a survival. Actually, like a... Um, there's a game I played a year or two ago called Die Young. I think it's been released on console recently. That had aspects of mountain climbing. It was a first person survival-ish game, but it wasn't harsh survival mechanics, which I liked. But I really enjoyed the parkour and climbing on it. It was some of the best bits climbing really high places. But it was more tropical rather than mountain. There wasn't really much snow in it. I would play a game like this if it was first person as well. Unreal. What a game. I think we were... Mate, I'm, I'm legendary at climbing mountains. You see the skills? Nothing could stop me. And it would have been even easier. Do you know what it is? I think I could probably manage it on hard. I don't know what they what what I don't know what the difference is on hard. Do you get to carry your character forward to hard? I don't think you Oh well no you won't because it's a it's a self-contained story within the three mountains, isn't it? I think I could probably manage on hard. Because I know the in and outs of the game, but it would involve taking it slower. Like the first island, just get everything you can, get as much experience, as many skills as you can before you get to the second island and then do the same thing. And also avoid getting injured. If you can avoid getting injured, I imagine you won't get any scars, so you won't have any negative penalties which see you throughout the entire game. Okay lads, well I hope you enjoyed Insurmountable, I would highly recommend it, it's been a lot of fun. See you in the next one lads.